Hey, this is Brian with Side Plan. You know, one thing that we uh, we hear a lot of from our clients is, you know, Brian, you know, just w tell me what to do. What, what do I need to do? Where do I need to start? And a lot and a lot of folks are already kind of jumping into, you know, buying their tech, right, and implementing it. Like I bought an AV, I bought a firewall, I bought this, I bought that. You know, am I secure? Did I did I buy the right things? And and these are all really great, and you need to get to them. But they're also very tactical, right? I think our approach and what we're saying is start with some type of <laughs> strategy. If you could spell correctly, or if I could, that'd be helpful. Um, allow yourself the moment to figure out a game plan before you start jumping in and purchasing technologies that are going to, you know, ideally uh, reduce the risk that you have. And, and you might get to this, right? You might actually have these things in place, but what informed you of, of that being the right decision? And, you know, the area that I like to start with, right, is a set of standards. Now, I'm a fan of NIST, right, and the NIST CSF specifically. And within here, right, we have 108, used to be 98 controls that set up uh, a really nice, well-organized, easy to understand set of controls Identify, protect, detect, respond, and recover. And here we have five families that we can look across our controls and be able to figure out where we're good, where we're bad, where we need some work. Most people are just jumping right here. And how do you know if, you, uh, if you're doing all the right things? How do you know if what you've purchased, maybe even some type of processes that you've put in place, or heck, even you know, gotten the right people, right? People process technology. Have you gotten uh, the right people? Do you even know what it is you need to do first or foremost? What told you that? Well, if you back up a bit, take some time, build out around something that's a standard, something that's recognized. So we really like NIST. We like high trust for healthcare, um, but we like NIST for, for non-healthcare. Um, it can be applied to healthcare as well, we're doing that. And that's that's a good, you know, it's, it's a good segue for something later. But really, how are we doing these controls, right? How are we looking at each of these and where are we applying them? How are we looking at them? What's the lens? So center on uh, a set of standards or a standard with a set of controls that's easy enough to understand, be able to digest, and allow this to inform what tech you're going to go with, what processes you're going to change or implement, and even maybe what people you want to go ahead and hire.